So that's why we put guys in gaps, because we taking over the gaps. You guys got to use your instincts, because we're not robots out here. You got to use your, you know, that, 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 that baseball instincts that you have to make the move, especially with two strikes. You get in the green, it's up to you to move to where you think you're going to hit it shallow, how you move. That's on you. That's being the gold glove outfielders that you are. And that's what made you guys gold glove, because you was able to get that good jump, which is one of the metrics that bring a gold glove. Glove, so that's what that is. That's the starting point. Good. Yeah, it's, it's thick grass, so it's thick. Is that what it is? Thick? Yeah. Mm-hmm. Oh. Okay. What's the best part here? In golf? Uh -huh. Nothing. <laughs> What's the worst part of my game and golf? Everything. <laughs> Seriously, none of it's good. I look like I can play until you get on the course with me, and then it's brutal. In the range, everybody can play. Yeah. Make them. Make them. Four. You're so talented. You know, for me, it's, you know, getting away from the game. You guys should come out more often. I don't normally hit shots like that. <laughs> you know, getting away from baseball, you know, we play, you know, it's every day, every day, every day. And to be able to go out there and, you know, play, you know, every now and then and just, like I said, get away, clear your mind, you know, hang out with the boys, uh, you know, I think that's, it's, it's important for a season. See that gator? It's a big boy over there. We are in Florida. This is honestly out of my comfort zone right here. We get to grind and to be able to have something that at times I'm, I'm pretty good at, uh, it's, it's important. <laughs> Sometimes I'm really bad at it. Mm. About straight, huh? Maybe next year. Back in Northport with the Braves, I'm Kevin McAlpin. Opening day is five weeks from tomorrow, folks, so really things will be fierce. The competition will be fierce here in spring. How about Ozzie Albies and Ronald Acuna Jr.? They were spotted here at the complex today. Uh, Ronald Acuna Jr. saying 50-50 is the goal. Yeah. As the full squad files into camp, it brings a warm welcome for newest brave Marcelo Zuna. Marcelo, 
Those simulators are dialed up, man. What's up, dude? How are you, man? Oh, what's up, baby? Love you. Good to see you. What's up, baby? How you doing? How you doing? How you doing? Good, not much. Yeah, you're a lot smaller person. A little bit. <laughs> yeah, I got in. Uh, oh, what's up, bro? How you doing? I got here yesterday, but then this is my first day over here. Me and you together. Yeah, I love that. Same thing. It's good to see you, man. What's up, man? Good to see you. Hey, get up a little more. Right there. So when you come around and you see that ball right there, you got a chance to come and get it. Don't sit back and wait. That's an easy double. Okay? That's what I mean by come and get it. If you're not there, if it's hit too hard, and you want to do the backhand? Okay, but if you got a chance to come get it, come get it. Okay? I know, no, this, yeah. this is this is the ease you in, you know. Yeah, but no, ground ball is, I think, the biggest thing for Alfie. It's charging, coming through the ball, making sure. Okay, okay. Transfer and everything. There you go, nice, nice. Last one right here. Last one. You, you get yours yet? You want one? You're good out there. You, you see what, what's going on. You, you put yourself in the right position to make plays. So, all this information they gave you is just to, you know, have an idea of what it is, but you, you're the one that's seeing the hitter. You see something happen out there, the guy not hitting his outside spot, you're like, E, he's gonna pull, he's going inside. Then you move according to that, because you guys actually see what's going on out there in the game, more so than we do on the bench. You guys gotta use your instincts, because we're not robots out here. You gotta use your, you know, that, 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 that baseball instinct that you have to make the move, especially with two strikes. You get in the green, it's up to you to move to where you think you're gonna hit it shallow, how you move, that's on you. That's being the gold glove outfielders that you are. And that's what made you guys gold glove, because you was able to get that good jump, which is one of the metrics that bring a gold glove. Freddie, how many steps do you take over here when you take your normal? I usually do like three and a half. Three and a half? Yeah, okay, do, do the normal, do the normal. Let's start going, Kanda, do your normal. Uh-huh. Wash usually is saying something dumb to me right now. Okay, so we're going to ignore him. Two, three. Okay. That's normal, and then it's the where the third base is. If he's way over. That's your lead. Yeah. So what's your what's your steps to home plate? Like when when, when you we get going, yeah. I'll just, I'll just like this. Okay. Okay. Freddie see things a little differently, and faster just than a lot of guys. He, he just he just knows how to deal with people, with players, you know, with. With Eagles, uh, instrumental in, in him and Josh being close last year. Um, and he don't walk around as if this my team. I, I very rarely have I heard him say, this is my team. To be honest with you, I've never heard Freddie's not like that. But it's just that, you know, there's a way from based on what he learned from guys with Chipper and those guys before him. It's a way about you, a way you go about your business each and every day. And we all here to get better and we all here to win one thing, and that's the championship. Two. I like those. Yeah, I'll hand on that. It's a good one then, though. Watch how it's doing. Well. I'll hand on that one. <laughs> okay. I have a, I have a handshake. The game has changed a little bit. Um, I'm not the raw, raw yell. I think 
that's usually people just kind of gravitate toward that kind of stuff, but I like to lead by examples and on the field. Um, anybody can yell something, say something, but if you don't back it up, then what's the point? So I don't think I could have envisioned being 20 years old when you're around Chipper and Billy Wagner and Tim Hudson and those kind of guys. Am I, am I happy it's gone like this? Very much so. Um, you don't take that, I don't take that for granted. And I continue, no matter what my age is, to go out there and try and play 162 and play the game the right way. I thought the time was now last year. That's just, that's baseball though. I thought we had a good team. I thought we had a, really, a chance to win that World Series. Um, just didn't play up to our capabilities and especially me. So that's a bad taste um, from, the, from last year's playoff. So I think we've got a great team again. World Series or nothing. I think that's every single year for us now. Yeah, to face Freddie Freeman. That ball is gone. The Braves are back in front. Yeah, there's probably not going to be anybody that's more anxious to get going than Freddie is. Back to the chop house. Did he just turn out the lights? He did. A walk off homer from Freeman, and the Braves yeah. win it. Yeah. Every spring training begins with a team meeting. One thing about this club that, that I've always respected, I continue to respect, is you guys aren't afraid to work. Here, the players gain valuable information from manager Brian Snitker and his staff. The team is joined by some of the legends that form the legacy the Braves will continue to build upon in 2020. Big say, I want to wish you guys all the best. Have a great camp, you know, and I, and I know we will. I know you guys will work. You do. That's how you're. That's how you're wired. You guys are wired to work. And I, you know, people always ask me about this group. I said, you know, this, this is. You guys love to compete. You love to work. You love to do all that. That kind of stuff. All right, guys. Thanks. Did I tell you that I have some for you? No. This. Oh. You see these? When you look at when people look at it, they say, man, he's not in style. This this is too, this is when I play. This is 2020. I got you. Don't worry. Okay. So I'm a style with the shots. Yeah. The shots. Okay, with the beer. Okay. okay. Yeah. I like that. I like that. You know. Tomorrow you're gonna you're gonna be different. Like. Okay. All right. All right. Don't worry. All right. All right. I'll make sure. I'll make sure I get in front of the camera. Okay. Too. Yeah. Yeah. Cause you know I had the red. You know, trying to style with my red shoes. Got a blue though. Don't worry. No. Okay. Okay. So. Then I can go in front of Wash. Yeah. What about? No, no, no. He got his cool ones on. You know. Old school. Old school. Oh yeah, they know. That's when he wears the game. It's cool now. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> hey, I always got him in the 2020. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. So that's good. That's good. I can put these up now. Yes. Why do you love the game of baseball? Oh my God. Because it's a passion for me, like, this is everything. Like, I got my glove beside the bed, my bat, everything is, is there too, so. This is love, man. I grew up with, with this, and my dad always took me to the field, so that's what he wants, and that's what I love too, so. We both love baseball. You'll know when a ball is hitting, you gotta do something like that. But you're working to get here. That's what you're working to get to, just like you did. That was perfect work. Thank you. That was perfect work. And you don't need to take no more ground balls today, nice okay? Job, nice job. You go over in the stadium and hit, you don't need to be taking no more ground balls, that's enough. All right, thank We're you. gonna be all right. We're gonna get it. Margo, my pad. Man. 
his arm. I <laughs> give <laughs> <laughs> Ese está bien. Yo sé que no dice como quieras, pero ¿sabes por qué me gustó? Pues todo es un dog con la Rai. E eso me gustó. Esto así. Como que. Y de ahí vamos. Es lo que estamos haciendo ahí. Estás ¿no? suelto. ¡Wow! ¿Ves? Y ahorita sí, sí se te ve más te como que. Ahí, ahí digo bien juego desde adentro. El bate está totalmente así. Como nomás está descansando aquí, ¿no? Y de ahí, vamos. Hasta lo tienes totalmente hacia esta casa. Ya, ahí está bien. Ya, suave, suave. Tranquilo. Lo tienes como ahí nomás. Y de ahí. ¿Vamos a hacer eso de nuevo? ¡Ya! You're good. You're good. You're good. Hey, nice, nice tag. You know, it's more of at the end of the day, yeah, it's a competition where we're competing for a job, but at the same time, we're trying to help each other get better uh, and and ultimately help the team win a championship. Whether you know I'm at third and you know he's filling another role, or if he's at third and I'm filling another role, you know, it's just that thing. You know, we we go through the grind together. Uh, so like you said, you never wish anything bad on anybody, you know, helping them, you know, like I said, going through that same grind together. And that's, that kind of, you know, forms that, that bond that, you know, you look for in a team that, you know, that wins the World Series. We always be brother, so it doesn't matter about the competition. I know people talk like about that, but to be honest, this year we just won. The only thing that important is just win and that's, that's the only thing that I care about it right now. So it's nothing that I can say. Like he's he's my brother, so I I, I can say anything bad about him, asking. He's <laughs> just like boom. You know, last year I was catching myself. You know, with that front elbow coming down, um, and it wouldn't let my back. So I was just tying myself, tying tying myself up, and and fouling a lot of pitches off, a lot of swing and misses. And, you know, we were sitting in the uh, video room last year, and, you know, he talked about that weight being evenly throughout your foot. Um, and that made a lot of sense to me, and because I've always been taught, keep it on like a ball of your foot. Um, and I've always been, you know, had a tendency to slide. So now, you know, with that with that weight evenly on my foot, I don't slide, I'm, I'm rotating through the center of my body. And, you know, it's just a more cleaner, fluent, uh, compact swing. I think Austin hopefully is on the same track as Ozzy two years ago. Uh, he had a great first half and struggled in the second half. Had a great season last year. Swing and a drive! Ball to deep left center! He's got a homer! He looks great. Swing is a lot cleaner, shorter. Um, Johan Camargo in 2018, it, he, he, was, he was great. Swing and a drive down the line! hit 275 with 18 and 70, I mean, and play pretty good defense. I don't know what else you can really ask from someone. So um, if he does that and Austin does that, well, you, it's going to be a great battle in spring training. Thank you. Thank you. You're welcome. Favorite player. Thank you. This year is important for everybody. So everybody, I think, they know what, what they want, I know what I want too. Everybody wants to be there in the World Series one day, so this is the goal and, and nobody can change that.
So the first from Felix, and we are underway in Northport. Things happen along the way. You know, you got to get in the playoffs because once you get there, anything can happen. I don't think we're going to miss a beat with this offense. I just feel like we've got a really complete team.